not what your country can do for you. Ask what you can do for your country. Every nation today should know, be he friend or foe, free men cannot be frightened by threat. Men are not afraid to die. The path we have chosen for the present is full of hazards, as all paths are. But it is the one most consistent. With our character and courage, and our commitments around the world. The cost of freedom is always high, and one path we shall never choose, and that is the path of surrender or submission. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other thing, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. I pledge you that we shall neither commit nor provoke aggression. That we shall neither flee nor invoke the threat of force. That we shall never negotiate out of fear. And we shall never fear to negotiate. I believe, and where no man is denied how to act, merely because his religion. I am talking about genuine peace, the kind of peace that makes life on earth worth living, the kind that enables men and nations to grow, and to hope and build a better life for their children. Not merely peace for Americans, but peace for all men and women. Not merely peace in our time, but peace in all time.